Hello, my name is Stephanie Haynes and I'm going to demonstrate to you how to crimp hair. There is a key to having beautiful, even crimps in your hair. You don't want them to be uneven. You want the whole row of crimp to match each other. So what you'll do is you'll spray the hair with the spritz. Getting your crimping iron out. You will place it on the hair about a half an inch from the scalp. Let it sit a few seconds until the crimp is formed. And then it is important to make sure instead of going here to our next row, you want the top of the crimping iron to be on top of the last crimp of the hair. As so. This makes sure that the crimps don't have a line in between or an additional space. They'll, it'll be even and it'll just ridge like it should. For the next row of curls, you part the crimp, part the hair, you take the crimping iron again and you want to make sure. Now sometimes it's a, you can take a little piece of the crimp that you just formed Put it with the hair that you're about to crimp and that will give you a platform or a base so to speak so that you can make sure that the next set of crimps are even with the first set of crimps. Okay, see we use this small piece of hair here and so that blended in both row of crimps. And it is important to make sure that your your crimping irons stay as hot as possible. Not too hot because you don't want to apply too much heat, but enough to form the crimp. Parting the hair again. And we're going to pull away from the last crimp. And spray. using the last crimp. And you can tell that they're even because you look at where the ridges are. These ridges are all together. Now here it might be a little tricky because you have the part that's here. So it's not coming around even. So that means what we're going to have to do is once we spray it and get the crimping iron, pull the little piece of hair from the previous crimp, smooth it down to where the ridge starts, which is here. Hold the hair up and then crimp. My name is Stephanie Haynes and I just demonstrated to you how to use a crimping iron.